Hi everyone. In this video, I am going to explain about an example problem on design of combinational circuit. So here, the design of combinational circuit always consists of three steps as I said earlier, truth table, uh, K maps and then logic circuit. So here the question is, design a combinational circuit that accepts, design a combinational circuit that accepts that accepts 3 bit BCD number, 3 bit BCD number, 3 bit BCD number and generates an output and gives an output binary number equal to the square of the input number output equal to the square of input number square of input number okay so if you see the question clearly design a combinational circuit now we need to design a combinational circuit that accepts 3 bit bcd number that accepts 3 bit bcd number is nothing but the input is nothing but a 3 bit bcd number accepts replicates the input so 3 bit bcd number but we know the bcd number has a maximum of 9 9 means that is a 4 bit number but it is a 3 bit number so 0 to 7 all the bits will come in this 3 bit bcd number there is no problem with this 3 bit 3 bit number and gives an output equal to the square of the input because so normally when you are having a decimal number like 1 2 3 4 5 then you can find the square 2 square is 4 5 square is 25 like that we can calculate but when you are going for the digits format then you have to represent the corresponding square in terms of its equivalent binary format if i say 5 5 is nothing but 5 5 is a 25 so 25 must be represented in binary format okay so for that the maximum number is 9 uh, sorry maximum number is 7 which is a 3 bit number the maximum number in 3 bits is triple 1 so that is 7 7 7s are 49 that 49 represented in that 49 represented in a maximum of 6 digits that's why we are going to take a 6 digits as output we are going to take 6 binary data 6 bit binary data as output okay that we need to first analyze <coughs> so solution for this one first we need to draw the truth table so for that input is a 3 bit number input is a 3 bit number so we are taking 3 bits like a b c and output is the square of output is the square of input so as there are 3 bits in the input the maximum number is 9 sorry maximum number is 7 in input in input so the result that gives the result is equal to 7 square nothing but 49 so to represent 49 to represent 49 we have we have we need 6 digits ok so that is 1 1 triple 0 1 so 2 power 0 2 power 1 2 3 2 power 4 and 2 power 5 2 power 5 is 32 2 power 4 is 16 and it is 1 so the total is 48 and 49 so total is 49 so for that we need a total digits of 6 okay so truth table truth table inputs a b c as i said earlier input and outputs we have x5 x4 x3 x2 x1 x0 so it starts from 3 0 
జీరో జీరో వన్ జీరో వన్ జీరో జీరో వన్ 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 జీరో జీరో వన్ జీరో వన్ 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 జీరో అండ్ ట్రిపుల్ వన్ ఓకే సో జీరో స్క్వేర్ ఈజ్ జీరో ఓన్లీ సో ఆల్ బిట్స్ ఆర్ జీరోస్ వన్ స్క్వేర్ ఈజ్ వన్ ఓన్లీ సో ఇట్ ఈస్ ఆల్సో ఆల్ జీరోస్ వన్ అండ్ టూ స్క్వేర్ ఈజ్ ఫోర్ ఫోర్ వి నో సో త్రిపుల్ జీరో వన్ డబల్ జీరో అండ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ త్రీ త్రీ స్క్వేర్ నైన్ సో జీరో 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 సారీ జీరో జీరో వన్ జీరో జీరో వన్ అండ్ దిస్ ఈస్ ఫోర్ ఫోర్ స్క్వేర్ ఈ సిక్స్టీన్ సో టూ పవర్ ఫోర్ హియర్ వీ హ్యావ్ వన్ అండ్ రిమైనింగ్ ఆల్ ఆర్ జీరోస్ అండ్ ఫైవ్ ఫైవ్ స్క్వేర్ ఈజ్ ట్వంటీ ఫైవ్ సో దట్ ఈస్ టేకెన్ యాజ్ జీరో వన్ వన్ డబల్ జీరో వన్ సో సిక్స్టీన్ ప్లస్ ఎయిట్ ట్వంటీ ఫోర్ ప్లస్ వన్ ట్వంటీ ఫైవ్ అండ్ సిక్స్ 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 థర్టీ సిక్స్ సో దట్ ఈస్ రిప్రజెంటెడ్ యాజ్ వన్ బికాస్ ఇట్ ఈస్ థర్టీ టూ ప్లస్ ఫోర్ ఈజ్ నీడెడ్ సో ఫోర్ మీన్స్ ఇయర్ so 100100 and last one 77 is nothing but 11001 okay so this is what this is what the truth table between input and output so all the inputs are here the inputs are 3 bit input and the corresponding square output is shown for 6 bits now our purpose is to find the find the expression for all these x0 x1 x2 x3 x4 and x5 okay see here for these expressions you don't need to go for k map simple expressions we can directly draw because ones are very rare here okay one thing is we can go to k map and simplify that is also easy but here we don't need to go for the k map because there are very uh, little number of ones that are existed in this particular truth table so now go to the k map sorry k map is not necessary and directly we can draw the the expressions for output the expressions for output variables is so x0 is equal to x0 is nothing but here we have a bar b bar c a bar b bar c plus and we have one at this place where a bar b c plus and one is here a b bar c a b bar c plus and again last a b c plus a b c so that is equal to if you take a bar common it will give a bar c plus uh, b c okay if you take a common that is also a bar b c b bar c uh, i see if you take b bar c common that will give a plus a bar and if you take bc common that will give also a plus a bar a plus a bar is nothing but 1 1 0 1 0 so it is 1 so b bar c plus bc again if you take c common then it is b plus b bar nothing but c so x0 is equal to simply c and similarly x1 is equal to from the table x1 is equal to simply 0 x1 is not having any one here so x1 is equal to 0 and coming to x2 x2 is 1 at a bar b c bar a bar b c bar plus and one more one here a b c bar a b c bar so b c bar if you take common it is a plus a bar nothing but bc bar only 
x2 and next x3 x3 is 1 at two places a bar bc a b bar c a bar bc plus a b bar c so that is equal to uh, is there anything to take common so c if you take common then it will give you a x r b it gives you a x r b because it is a bar b plus a b bar next x4 x4 is 1 at 3 places 4 5 and 7 4 5 and 7 so 4 5 7 so that is equal to if you take a common a b bar b bar b c bar c c if you take a common then it is b bar c bar plus b bar c plus b c that is equal to a again if you take uh, b bar common here c plus c bar plus b c c plus c bar means 1 so it simply gives b bar plus b c b bar plus b c and this is also again equal to b bar plus b c is nothing but b plus c b bar plus c so a into b bar plus c this is x4 and the last one x5 x5 is 1 at only last two places 6 and 7 so a bar for a b c bar plus a b c so if you take a uh, c common c a b common c plus c bar is 1 so it is a b it is equal to x5 is equal to a b now if you draw the logic circuit diagram for this one logic circuit for this one so x1 is x1 is nothing but c only x2 is not there it is 0 and x3 is having 1 and gate x3 is having 1 and gate with the b c bar and x4 has 1 and gate and 1 xr gate xr gate and 1 and gate output of xr gate passes through and gate with another input of and gate as c a b x4 sorry x3 it is x2 x2 is 0 x1 sorry the x0 this is x0 x1 x2 and this is x3 and now x4 x4 is 1 and gate and 1 or gate or gate and 1 and gate or gate and 1 and gate so x4 or gate between a b bar c and this is a and one more and gate is needed for x5 x5 which is having a b inputs okay so this is a simple logic circuit if you connect all these if you take a a bar b b bar c c bar all these and drawing the lines down then you can have a circuit of with all together okay so this is the way of designing a logic circuit for the square output thank you